This video demonstrates the effect of confinement on strength of sands. Materials needed for this experiment are a rod labeled at one inch intervals, a sand and beaker, and sand laid out on the table. So now we're going to proceed with the experiment placing the rod in the loose sand on the table. The rod settles about half an inch under its own weight on the loose sand. Now if you place the rod in the confined sand, it doesn't settle at all. It needs more force to settle about the same amount as the loose sand did. As we're applying force, it's hard to penetrate the rod the same depth as it did the loose sand because of the confinement strength. This completes the rod demonstration. Now we're going to continue the demonstration of effective confinement on strength of sands using a weight instead of the rod. Here are our two weights. We still have the same beaker of sand and loose sand sitting on our lab table. First thing we're going to do is place the weights on the loose sand and see what happens. Notice how the sand sinks under the weight of one weight. All right. The sand sinks. Now we're going to try the same experiment with the confined sand in the beaker. The weight does not settle at all. Even with two weights, the strength of the sand in the beaker is higher than the strength of the sand sitting on the table. This is because of the confinement strength. Even when we apply more force, the sand remains firm. This completes our experiment.